Hi everybody, it's me Kim. How's everybody, how's everybody doing? Okay, I want to come to you today with some concealers. Most of them I've been using for this year and um, half of 2018. But if you're my complexion, have dark circles, uh, like to brighten, um, then maybe this can work for you because these are the reasons why I use them. Okay, they're in no particular order. They're just, I'm just gonna, you know, give you the information as I see fit. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the Juvia's Place. And I have this in J11, J stands for Juvia. And 11, now they, this concealer comes in, I think 15 shades, if I'm not mistaken. Now the reason why I picked J11, because I was going for a highlighting look. Um, I wasn't, no, I'm sorry, I was going for the brightening look. And I paired it up with my Juvia's Place um, 240. So I used these together with this because I couldn't find the shade I wanted in my um, foundation. I had to go a shade up. So that means it was going to be a little darker for me. So I wanted to brighten up my eyes so it would all even out. That's why I picked J11. And this is a matte concealer. And it really does work really good. Um, I haven't worn it too, too much. But the times I have worn it, it has worked pretty well for me. And it does kind of brighten up my eyes. So, J11 Juvia's Place. Pretty good. And it's matte. And next, I have the... Um, what is this? The um, Beauty Bakery. Now, I have Insta Bake Concealer. And I have this one in Pretzelvania. Now this concealer was more so to wear um, with the, if I didn't want to wear makeup. So if I didn't want to wear makeup, I could just pop this under my eyes and just blend it in and it would just conceal my eyes and it would be like on the shade of my, um, almost the shade of my skin. And here I'll show you a swatch of it. You see? So when I blend it in, let's take one of these blenders. When I blend it in under my eyes, you see what I mean? That's one of the reasons why I have this one. And again, this is Pretzelvania and Beauty Bakery. And another concealer I just got that I'm really, really feeling is the Essence brand of um, Camouflage. And this is a matte concealer too. Oh, um, Pressylvania was matte too. Um, it's a matte, the Essence is a matte concealer too. And it basically covers tattoos. So it really was on the line for me for covering up my dark circles. And also a cover up for when I don't want to wear makeup. See? And you see, I'll blend it in again. So the days I don't feel like wearing makeup, I gravitate towards these two. Just pop them under my eyes, do my brows, put on some lip gloss, and go. Quick fix. Okay, another one of my concealers now. Now we'll go with the concealers that I use to conceal under my eyes and brighten for my foundation. And that would be the NARS. Now, I got this one in a mini because I was testing out because I heard a lot of people saying that NARS concealer was pretty good. And it's pretty good, but I got this one a little too light. So, eh, I use it every now and then or I will mix it with something else. But I do use it. And um, it's, a, it's a pretty decent um concealer um i just don't know too much about it but i wanted to just bring it to your attention that it is you know available okay another one that i like is the covergirl true blend undercover now this one is pretty good too now i use this one to brighten up under my eyes because this is two shades lighter than my um found foundation would be so I use it to brighten up under my eyes after I put on my foundation. It's not matte though. And K2 
can't stop, won't stop. As you see, I have two of them. I have one on the orangey side and I have one on the fair side. Now, I picked this one up by mistake, so I went back and got this one. And when I went back and got this one, I thought about concealing more than highlighting. So this one I use for a concealer under my makeup. Um, and this one I use for after I, I put this on first, then I put on the makeup, then I put this on. Or sometimes what I do, because they're both matte, sometimes I put them on together and just put one here and one there. And so that's how I use these two. And these are by the brand NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop. And these are the matte concealers. And these work really, really, really good. I like to use these in the summertime though. And another one I like now, I'm really starting to like this brand called Rimmel. Rimmel has very good products and um, they're basically for people that have oily skin or oily to combination skin. And this one is the um, uh, Stay Matte Concealer. And this one is an amber. And I use this one for highlighting. And it's a matte concealer. Oh, and if I didn't tell you the, the names of the ones I showed you already, I'll put them in the description. I'll put a list in the description, okay, guys? And um, the Milani Concealer, the um, Conceal Imperfect. I wasn't too fond of this concealer, but because I spent my money, I use it every now and then. Um, it just, for me, it didn't do the trick for concealing my under eye, um, darkness under my eyes, because that's my area where I think that's the only reason why I wear makeup because my skin is pretty good I take care of my skin I have a skin regimen so I take care of my skin but I do have dark circles under my eyes so I mean it's not a bad brand I have other Milani stuff but I'm just not really a fan of this concealer um this one's in deep tan and another one is the Pacifica. Now, I like this one. This one is really good. Um, this is the brand of Pacifica. I have foundation up here with the gold top. I don't know if you can see it. It's with the gold top. I brought those two together. Um, I have the this um, concealer in 3WD um, Warm Deep. And as you can see, it's I use this one more so as a brightener. And it's a full coverage, long lasting concealer. And I can say it does last long under my eyes and it did conceal under my eyes. And so those are my concealers. Um, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, concealing is a big part of my foundation um, because um, for me, putting on foundation is cool, but if you conceal and contour, that all plays a big part in your makeup regimen um you know it brings color back to your face and takes away color and you know cancels out colors and stuff like that so that's all i wanted to say and um i'll leave the color shades in the bottom of the description but i just wanted to show you guys my concealers of 2019 and um bye